Hello, awesome readers. Today we're going to be reading "Little Blue Truck Makes a Friend" by Alice Shirtle. Horn went beep, engine purred, friendliest sounds you ever heard. Little Blue Truck was on the road, taking a drive with good friend Toad. Hen came running, cluck cluck cluck. I've got news! Stop, little blue truck! Someone moved in down the road. Someone different, blue and toad. Honk said Goose. No feathers, I've heard. Quack said Duck. He's a very strange bird. Nay said Horse. Does he gallop around? Do his hoofs make a clippity cloppity sound? Moo said cow. What a cow would be doing is standing around just quietly chewing. Oink sniffed pig. You can see he can't be a pig if he's not like me. Quack said duck. Can he swim? Does he float? Ma! How high can he jump? said goat. Sheep said, "Ba." Is he short? Is he tall? I heard he has no wool at all. Beep said Blue. What's all the fuss? He's not like any one of us. Somebody new? Let's go see. Beep. Who wants to ride with me? They scrambled into Little Blue Truck with a moo and a quack and a cluck cluck cluck. Ma said, "Go!" and he jumped in too. Off they went with Toad and Blue. Into the meadow, through the grass, bees and butterflies watched them pass. Up a hill, and there they found a little round door in a grassy mound. Woodchuck's house said a sign on the door. They never seen a house like that before. This isn't a coop or a barn or a pen. Cluck! He lives in a hole," said Hen. "Looks cozy to me," said Little Blue Truck. Then the door swung open, and out stepped Chuck. "Run!" honked Goose. Duck quacked, "Hide!" Hen found a pail and jumped inside. Goat jumped over a pile of rocks. Pig crawled under some hollyhocks. Horse slept over a low stone wall, which didn't hide much of horse at all. A tree was all that cow could find. A lot of cow stuck out behind. Wherever they hid, they peeked at Blue. And waited to see what Chuck would do. Little Blue's beep was loud and clear. We are very glad you're here. Croak said Toad, and beep said Blue. Just stopped by to welcome you. Chuck thumped his feet on the grassy mound and whistled "Wee!" with a friendly sound. I was all alone and feeling shy. I sure am glad that you stopped by. Are there other friends about? Croak! Laughed Toad. Come on out. They gathered round, and Chuck said, "Wee!" More new friends to visit me. First came Hen, then Goat and Cow. Let's make friends. Blue showed us how. Quack said, "Duck and horse said, 'Nay, we didn't need to run away.'" Beep said, "Blue, would you like a ride? We'll show you around the countryside." They scrambled into Little Blue Truck, and they all made room for their new friend Chuck. Beep beep beep. The end.
Thank you so much for reading with me. If you enjoyed, please don't forget to like and subscribe so that we can read together again.